To access the control panel, uh, click Start, Setup, Control Panel. And this opens up uh, all of your settings for SI 2015. So um, wire settings, if you double click this, um, all that uh, is out here is the default wire length. And it's set to 100 feet. Of course, you can change that. Um, this will be meters if your Windows settings are set to meters. Uh, and what this is for is for bulk wire. So um, I'm going to demonstrate that uh, right now. We'll save it at 100 feet. Um, where you'll really see this come into play is within a project. So let's go ahead and pull up a project here. And um, on the settings tab out here in the project, you could modify this if you wanted to. There's the wire settings option here. So if this was like a larger project and you want to put, you know, 150 feet as the default, you certainly can. Um, but we'll go ahead and just cancel out of this. And I'll add a bulk wire uh, to the project. So pick a location, pick a system, and we'll go find a product here. I've already filtered this. Uh, we'll pull in a wire drop it into the project. And this is where that wire length comes into play. Uh, because this is a piece of bulk wire, it's designated as bulk wire, meaning it's coming off of a spool. So it's gonna charge you know, per drop and uh, the footage per drop, or um, of course that could be meters, like I said. Uh, you can easily change this. If you, in this case, wanna bump this down to a 50 foot run, you certainly can. Um, you can also pick a head end and a start terminal and an end terminal here. That's more for doing Visio drawings and when you're doing installation reports, but since we're here, we'll go ahead and assign that. Um, even though this video, the focus will be this wire length. Hit assign, and the uh, bulk wire has been added to the project file um, at a length of 50 feet. So uh, what makes this a bulk wire is the on the specifications tab, there is a bulk wire option here. So if any wire and cable product that you put in here is like a pre-terminated cable, like an HDMI cable, uh, you would not mark that as bulk. It would be a, you know, a specific length in the model number. But because this is bulk, uh, the wire length will vary, and that's where this setting comes into play. So, um, Also, while we're here just talking about bulk wire, you always price bulk wire by the foot or by the meter. Um, that's what you see here. And you set your labor by the foot or by the meter. So when you're looking at this installation price down here for this particular product, it's showing $34 you view this uh, that's all based on in this case we're calling it the quantity but that's the length that there are 50 feet of wire that has been added to this job